open up ass glow. <laughs> What's up, homie? What's up, homie? It's all good. My dad's really happy with me. He loves you, too. Your dad loves me? Oh, he loves everybody. Oh, that's cool. Yo, like, even when they catch his wave, or when he gets cut in line at the amusement park, or even when he orders a chai latte, and somebody steals it, and then the man's like, who in God's name ordered a chai latte? Oh, shit, he sounds like a cool dude. I mean, he used to be a little bit nasty, but then I came around and he cracked me. Man, I never really knew my dad. Yeah, he's kind of distant, though. I mean, he travels a lot. It's kind of crazy, but I still love him, even though all my friends say I shouldn't because of what he did to me. All right, man, look, I got to get back to my matter. Yo, it's cool, homie. Be cool. So what's up, man? Sit down and face forward. Now, I don't have a lot of time. I know you need money. Did Michael tell you about Life Invader? Oh, shit. Y'all two did that? Look forward. We're two strangers having a friendly chat. And don't pretend that you liked Jane Norris. Oh, man, I don't know, homie. I mean, yeah, the dude I sourced worked to child slaves. Then stole and sold everybody's private information. And even ripped his own friend's ideas off and walked around like the Messiah while doing it, but... Man, I don't think the nigga deserved to have his fucking head blowed off on TV. Oh, well, aren't you just a moral majority? You know, that's why the world is the way it is today, when a paid thug gets all namby-pamby when someone asks him to act like a paid thug and for a good cause. Man, check this out, homie. I like blowing motherfucking fools' heads off just as much as the next psychotic asshole. But I just don't look at the shit as doing a good deed. Well, now you can, because it's not fools' heads, it's assholes' heads. And not just heads, you know, trashing cars or planting lies, forging evidence, anything we can do to take the battle back to these turds. You know, we'll fix the market in our favor and we'll right a few wrongs while we're at it. <laughs> shit, okay, cool. Right, so, you heard of Mollus? 
Hell yeah. Okay, so there's a new mollusk, sort of a super mollusk, and it's called Priapoles, and it's giving the living rigor mortis. Only Brett Lowry, CEO of Bilkington Research, paid off the FDA, and he doesn't care that his hardness pills are giving desperate middle-aged men the world over heart attacks. Damn, man, that sucks. Yeah, it does. Now, Mr. Greedy Lowry is staying at the Von Krastenberg Hotel in Richmond, of course, he'll be well protected, but if he goes away, then America goes back to using mollusks, and Beta Pharmaceuticals gets a big bump in the price of their stock. Damn, man. All right. Fuck it. I got you. I thought that you would. Now, consider using a sniper rifle or sticky bombs. You know, whatever. Do it your way, however you want. I'm going to make the investment. We don't speak about this or anything. Now walk away, and I'll stay here till you're gone. I got ten bucks says someone's gonna get a little drive by tonight. I bet you'll be ready to use that.
Let's move it out, people! We need this area cleared! Let's move it out, people! We need this area cleared! 